I've always wanted to test the lockpick. See the lockpick right here? I want to... See, I can lock the door with the lockpick. What other doors do we got here? Can we lock ourselves in here? This is the... Oh, this is the other way in. Well, let's put the lockpick away. It was in the room. No. If I need to get out, I need to get out. So what I'm going to do right now, I'm going to use the lockpick. I'm going to see how many times we can use it before it breaks, and we don't use it anymore. So we just know for our own knowledge. So I got the lockpick right here. I'm going to lock the door by holding. This is first lock. First unlock. First lock. Our second lo lock. And second unlock. Alright, let's check the quality of it. It's still pristine after that. I'm gonna lock the door. This is the third time. This is three. Four. Four. Un lock and unlock. Oh, I think that just changed the quality of it. It's worn now. So remember, if you guys don't know already, it's pristine, worn, damaged, badly damaged, then ruined. Once you have something ruined, you can't repair it. With pick lock, lock picks, I don't think you can fix it once it's at any level. Maybe um, a sharpening tool might be able to fix the lock pick, but I'm not sure. But that's good to know. So I think it's going to be four unlock and lock before you go to the next level. So if I wanted to try that again, I can go to damaged by doing it four times. But we don't need to do that. I don't want to lock pick. I don't know when I'm going to find another one on the map. So that's good to go. Thank you for watching that clip. This is D exclusive from DXWorldMedia.com, where dreams choose you.